Hello viewers, welcome back to my channel. So, today's video is going to be on the topic of 20 cm long worm in the human eye, first ever recorded. So, before starting this video, if you haven't subscribed my channel, then like, subscribe and share and press the bell icon to never miss an update and comment below. Okay, so let's start the video. A 20 cm long worm in the human eye first ever recorded in Trivandapuram, Kerala in India. Dr. Ashley Thomas Mula Mutil, the doctor who recorded this unique surgery says that this is the seventh worm that he has removed in the last one decade and it is also the longest. The worm Loa Loa was originally found in Africa and has now reached Asia. The mangrove fly or deer fly is believed to be the carrier of this worm. The eggs of the worm enter the human body through a small wound inflicted by the fly. The death of the worm inside the body could be fatal as it could contaminate the blood. So the disease is known as microfleriasis or loa loa infestation liosis okay so now the next question arises that how does loa loa worm get to the eye so loasis called african eye worm by most people is caused by the parasitic worm loa loa it is passed on humans through the repeated bites of deer flies also known as mango flies or mangrove flies on the genus Cripsops. The flies that pass on the parasite breed in certain rainforests of West and Central Asia. Okay, so is lower lower painful? Lower lower does not normally affect one's vision but can be painful when moving about the eyeball or across the bridge of the nose. So the disease can cause red itchy swelling below the skin called calabar swellings. So next, the, now the next question arises, can you get lower lower in the United States? So, liosis is not required in the United States. Some cases have been reported in travelers and immigrants from endemic areas. So now, the next question arises that what does a worm in your eye look like? So the presence of floaters, small spots or lines in your field of vision, sensitivity to light, crusting around the eyelids and eyelashes, redness and itching around the eye. So that's all about this video. If you like the video then like, subscribe and share and press the bell icon to never miss an update. Thank you.